Hi, my name's Jordan, and I've been at Live Church for probably about most of my life, probably since I've been like six or six or seven. But I was born like three or four months early, and um, I ended up having to go to Vanderbilt for about four months of my life just to get withdrawn from drugs because my mom wouldn't stop doing drugs. I remember. Um, growing up, I would always be a shy kid because I got diagnosed with autism and um, I would not really, I would always want to c- connect with people, but it would always be super hard for me. I remember like one of the first times I really felt like I belonged was like whenever I started going to student life because they were always so kind, like as soon as I walked in the door, they always welcomed me with open the arms and with every event, they would always want me to come. They would always ask if I ever had trouble with money or anything, they would always divide. And it's, it's a great place. Student life is amazing. Um, they have amazing leaders. Um, They always make everybody feel comfortable. They try to get to every kid. They try not to leave anybody out. So about last year, I had a a season where I was getting hit with really bad depression. I like, I would like think my life was going, my life is going so good. Why? Why am I thinking like so horrible? Why am I having this depression? And as soon as they found out, like Davey, Matthias, they were all praying for me. They were all, they were like pray for me. They would just do anything they could just to get me out of the house, just to have me do something so I wouldn't feel alone. I went from a place where I was like dark in that depression, but now I'm like, I'm like able to serve, able to like give people food, able to like, if that somebody needs to talk to, I can be there and just to have that opportunity, I'm, I'm so blessed. So always whenever I was growing up, I always thought of myself as below and I felt God really talking to me whenever he says, you are above, not below, you are the head, not the tail. Always whenever I was growing up, I would always, I would, I would always pray to God and say, I'd be lucky if I could just live in your trash can in heaven and not be in hell. But I feel like God has really spoken to me It's like he sets a table and he like, he's like waiting for me. He's like, no, I want you right here. I don't want you eating the leftovers. I want you to be the first one to grab a bite. I'm Jordan Phillips and this is my story.